Okay, guys, we're back here in the in the dungeon, and um, let's see if we can't find some hidden treasure here. Some of the map is still rendering in. Um, as you recall, last time this is the Minotaur or the Mushroom Minotaur, I guess you could say, is the lair. Um, somewhere in this mess, there's always a hidden uh, chest room. And let's see if we can render out some of this map, a little more of this mapping, and find this. So hopefully it's not blown up or, or anything just yet. Let's keep going here. Come on now. Render out. Torch down here. Getting dark over here. What's... Hmm. See that big spot there in the in the center uh, where my crosshair is now see how that's all stone I don't know exactly what that is but that looks like it could be it um, now if I remember right we're gonna have to tunnel into this thing too so um, there could um, that be it right there Huh. That might be it, but it might not. I'm not real sure. I mean, it kind of looks like it, it could be. Um. Hmm. That's awful. Awful squarish. Let's, um. Let's get our speed 8 out here. See if we can't break through this. One block at a time. Now I'm going to turn my volume up in case you hear any trip wires or anything. This is going to be slow. Hopefully this isn't all maze stone here. Oh, are we full? Yeah, we need to get some stuff out of our inventory. Uh, get that out. That and that. Um, yeah, we'll leave that for now. Okay. I think we may have found it here, but you can tell these bricks are really hard. This is a speed eight pick. It's gonna take forever. Now there is pressure plates and trip wires, and we gotta get in here without blowing that up. That could be could be difficult. Let's see. Let's look at our mini map here. If I can remember how to do this. Uh, there we go. Oh yeah, that, that's looking like something there. Okay. Let's get in here. Let's keep digging. Oh. See, look, our, we're taking some damage. Pretty good damage there. Maybe we found it. Maybe we didn't. But there's only one way to tell. Don't want anything sneaking up behind us and setting anything off. Hmm. Might be a little bit of a waste of time, but a lot of maze stone in here. Something tells me it's really not a waste of time. Could be though. <laughs> doesn't uh, doesn't appear like it's like it's going to be. Come on now. Uh, let me see. We probably need to go in a couple more than turn to the left, maybe. Just if we look. And then we zoom in. Can I zoom in? There we go. See how this on the map it shows this whole center section black or just a uh, gray. But if we go to oh, take it off. There we go. If we go to here, it's just a big old gray blob. So we probably need to turn to the left here. Let's go one more. stone above us. Oh, okay, okay, here we are, here we are, here we are. Now look, those are pressure plates. Now anything that falls on those sets off the TNT, so we gotta be extremely careful here. You know, this, there's so much TNT here, it, it just blows sky high.
Okay, nice and easy. Nice and easy. There's TNT there. Let's get this. Look at there. Protection three, respiration three. Ooh, efficiency four, silk touch one. That's some good stuff there. All right, send that back. Um, that'd be good for now. Let's try to get this other one here. Hope none of these chests are trapped. Potion of swiftness. Got some good armor coming out of here. Bane of arthropods five. <laughs> okay. All right. Now hopefully. Man, this is where it gets trickier because there's another chest back there, but I don't want anything to land on top of these, so I should probably just. There we go. Break that one. Break this one above us. Now, somewhere in here. Oh! Oh! Whoa! There's a booby trap. Good thing that we broke, took that plate out. Okay, now. Should be able to reach the rest of these. Five emeralds, not bad. Protection three. Sharpness five, four. Knockback two. Pretty good. Um, looks like something's wrong with our system, or it's full. I'd say it's probably full. Uh, there it is, the maze breaker, and that's what we're after. Efficiency four and breaking three, fortune two. That thing should be pretty darn good. Okay. And. Man, that's a success. That is a success. I'll tell you what. Let's break this right here. And let's have a victory celebration. Come on. Light a few. Oh, okay, we're lit up pretty good here. <laughs> here we go. Oh. Oh, run. No. <laughs> now you can see what happens if you set that trap off. TNT out to Wazoo. Sand traps to set the rest of the traps off. Oh yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's see if we can't get out of here now. Um, probably just... Um, eh, we'll find our way out eventually. I hope. <laughs> oh, let's eat a little bit. This is all blown out. Bedrock up there. I think we came through here, didn't we? Yeah. Alright, alright. Um, I think we're trying to get to that spot. Nope, there's some dark area here. What we got in here? Nothing? Nope. Okay. We're trying to get to here. Oh, we got that, didn't we? Yeah. We fit him more in our ender chest. Sure thing. Got some good armor out of that deal. Some decent amount of potions. Um, did I just go back the way we came from? I hope not. <laughs> yeah, we've been in here. Over here, another blown up area, I think. Or the same blown up area, maybe. No, it's a different one. I think we got that. Or did we? Yeah, there's some TNT in there. Okay. Even though we've been through here, I'm still lost. <laughs> oh, that's just a dead end there. 
and go back to here. Hmm. Let's look at our map again. Okay, we need to get more along the lines in the lower left hand side. So straight left, left, left to get us. Okay. Straight, and we're going to take a left. Oh, there's already a. Okay. I need to go back. <laughs> Where are we going here? Nope. left here maybe yeah here we go uh, getting a little bit farther away maybe I was thinking right okay okay <laughs> this ain't really working out like I thought it would I'm trying to use the map at the same time there we go. There we go. Alright, let's go up a level. Okay, now to get out of this level. We didn't light much of this up at all. Ooh, there's another chest. I don't think this one's trapped either. Oh. Um, golden apple. Some iron. Take that paper. Okay, that's where we go down. I think we want to go. You know what? We could probably sneak out right here. Come on, torch me. Torch me. There we go. What's up here? Ooh, I think we're right. Yeah, sneak out right here. A little cheating. Come on. Give me sunshine. <laughs> and we're out. Alright. <laughs> I call that a success. Let's uh, let's jump back in the portal, head back to the house, and we will see what's up with our our ME system. So here we go. Alright. I hear you, zombie. Got a zombie on my roof. Pigmen over here. Holes in my roof. But I think somebody was goofing around and blew my house up. Um, oh, I probably didn't explain this glass. This is ethereal glass. You use it. You get it from um, surrounding a uh, division. Not a division. You get it and unstapling it. Surrounded by glass. And you can walk through it, but mobs can. It's pretty handy. I don't. I guess we're just full. Yeah, 63 of 63 types. So we've got all kinds of types in there. So one thing we're going to do is make us another 64k storage unit, which we knew that was bound to happen at some point. Um, let's try to put some of this gear up. And I never made a crafting terminal. Um, so we can't really get our items back at this point. So we need to do that real quick. Oh, well, this is all getting full. We're getting full up on stuff. Maze breaker. Alright, alright. Um, let's see here. Okay, let's look at a crafting terminal. We gotta we gotta do that so we can get to our stuff. ME crafting terminal. Storage cell. Basic processor. Do I have one of those? No. There's the pattern. I'm gonna need some piece of gold. Okay. Oh, I grabbed two. Oh well. Um, what else? Oh, silicone. We get? Oh, hey, we got one right here. Good. Uh, come on now. There we go. Let's cook this thing up real quick. 
Wow, that was a heck of an adventure there. Um, I think the next adventure we're going to look at doing, uh, maybe finding us a lich tower or um, a dark tower, maybe something like that. Uh, oh, stay in there. And then we're going to need some quartz and redstone, which I don't. Yeah, I need some more of that in here. Got plenty of redstone for now, anyway. Okay, in the corners, I think. Right there, and then in the cross. There's that storage cell. And I'm lost already. Crafting bench. Give me access terminal. Oh, man. Okay. I got some of that in there. Let's look that up. See, there's all kinds of little things in here that um, that get you confused. All right, so we need another one of these, which means I need more silicone, which means I don't remember how to make the silicone. Okay, just cook some dust up. We got that. Let's just do half of that. Then. Okay, give me one, give me one. Come on, come on. There we go. Grab one of those. Put that in here. Take that out for now. That in there so I know, remember to cook it. Come on. There you are. Um, okay. So we have the storage cell. We have some cable. And we need the ME access terminal, which means we need this. Okay. Two, three, four. That there. This. Uh, one of those. And some of this. I believe. All right. I should probably. Well, I don't really have a, I don't want to unlock these things, so let's just take that out of there. Bump something. And we put that there. Oh, well, this is a wild guess here. I'm, I'm sure I'm going to be wrong. Yeah, I know I'm wrong. Well, I was close. <laughs> I was closer than I thought I was. And the cable there. Now we have an access terminal. We're going to take that access terminal, put it back in there, the storage cell, put it back in there, and I'm lost. <laughs> There's just so many things. Okay. That and that. The crafting table. And iron. There we go. Now, let's move this for the time being. And plop this in here. And good, it's on. Now we can right click and we can see all of our inventory that's in there. And not only that, we can search for stuff like, um, let's go with steel. So we get all the steel leaf items that, that we put in there from adventuring. Um, so let's look what we got. Um, I managed to put some stuff in there earlier while, we was, while I was digging off camera. But there's the Minotaur Axe. And take this nether stuff out, take that out, take that out, uh, we can take some of that maize stone out, ooh, bunch of, I don't remember where I got all that from, probably mining I guess, and, and no, okay, oh, escape to get out, um, process ores go in here, or ores that need to be processed, there's another one hiding on me, Regular blocks go in there, but I'm going to start putting some in there. Hmm. Get rid of that. Give me that. These things are so handy. And even though that we've only got one storage cell at the moment, later on when we add 
more to it. Would there just be? Nope. Let me put that back in there. Um, there just be this whole thing would just be items one right after another. Uh, it reads every storage cell, not just one at a time. Okay, give me those. Probably cook that up. Cook that up. Oh, escape. Drop that in. This over here. This up. Mm, yeah, there we go. Alright, give me a few moments here to sort some stuff out. And I'm going to grab one piece of glowstone. Let's see, we're still doing good on food, doing good on weapons. We got the maze breaker with us. Um, all right. Well, that's good enough for now. We got all kinds of stuff in here. You guys want to look at these spoils bags? Let's see what we got out of them. Most of them came from those slimes. Some what I call bear claws. Hmm. Steel pickaxe. That's a good one. Some copper. Remember, we run out of room on that. We'll run out of room everywhere. Here's a general chest, I guess you could say. In there, put the copper there. Like I just been collecting these four smiths, just stashing them up here on the tool chest or the tool racks. Why not, huh? Oh, that one's just pretty much junk. Broken force shards. <laughs> it's terrible. Alright. Can I fit any No. Man, everything's getting full. Okay, what's this other one here? Come on, this would be the good one. Uh, no. Not, not even close. <laughs> not even close. I want that one back that I lost that had the portal gun in it. That's the one I want. Look back up here on the bookshelf. Okay. One thing I forgot to look for, and it should be easy to find once we're back in the Twilight world, um, is maize, no not maize wafers, um, torch berries. And we'll go over that in a second. We'll go ahead and leave this uh, crafting monitor here so we don't lose it. Uh, bucket of force can stay. Okay, what we got here? Alright, I think that's good. We can leave this map here. It doesn't really do us any good at this point, but you never know. Oh, should we enchant something? Yeah, let's put something on this um, this pick here. I know it has speed four on it. What else can we put on that? Uh, can we put efficiency on it as well? Wow, that would be awesome. Uh, and unbreaking. Let's do that. Wow, that thing's going to smoke through stone. Wow. Um... We bump this up to Fortune 3. And bump that up. No. Let's take it back out for a second. Bump that up to Fortune 3. Keep that efficiency unbreaking. There we go. Um, efficiency 4, Fortune 3, unbreaking 3. That's going to be a really good pick for us. That maze breaker. That's going to be really good. Now that I believe that's something that you can only find in those mazes. Could be wrong, but that's the only place I've ever found them. I don't even think you can craft them. A little more XP. Mm, that's so good. That's so good. All right. Oh, looks like our tree farm is waiting on some dirt again. We'll get back to that. For now, let's go back in here. Take a little nap, nap, and. Oh, we left use our crafting table, so I'm gonna need to find another chunk of wood here. There we go. We're 
gonna make us a magic map, but we also need two. Oh, I forgot. Yeah. Um, we're gonna also gonna need some torch berries. Hi, little Tweety Bird. Torch berries can be found pretty easily in uh, some small caves and stuff like that. Usually grows hanging from the ceiling. It's neat stuff. What is that? Is it just silver? Oh, it's tin. Okay. There's another one. Can't pass up tin. <laughs> I hear some slimes down there. Might as well get these two. Alright. Now, I'd seen a small cave that had some right at the beginning of it. Is it in here? There's some, yeah. Torch berries. Okay, now torch berries, we're gonna use in a crafting recipe. And you can also make torches out of them. Use it like coal, you know. Uh, let's take the raven's feather, a piece of glowstone, and a torch berry. And it makes magic map focus. With fire, it writes, huh? Huh. Surround that with paper. Now that is going to give us a blank magic map. I can see for miles. <laughs> These achievements are funny. Come on. Oh, let's try out our new pick. Speed 4, efficiency 5, unbreaking. Oh my! Oh, <laughs> that thing is fast. Holy cow, what's in here? A little bit of tin, some iron. These caves can be dangerous, man. There's all kinds of little critters in here. Anyway, let's get back to what we was doing. You can um, silk touch those torch berries and get the whole plant, and they make nice little decorations, so I, I don't want to bust them just yet. All right, so magic map, blank magic map. I think we'll have to fly around and render this thing out, which now you can see why we wanted this map. Now, oh, on this map you can see in all the um, the ore mounds, the, the Lich King. There's, I think that's a, a Naga down there. Now it tells you where all the Magical creatures are at. Let's get going here. Alright, here we go. Probably can't fly around very long because down to 76%. Okay. There's something coming up here. Uh, so, well, maybe them are Minotaur dungeons there because that's on my right. There's something on my left. What is that? A small little ore mound, maybe? They're right on top of it. What is that? Yeah, it's a little ore mound. Those are full of ores, and we will explore those. Um, just not right now. Uh, I want to try and get this this map build up for you guys. In the next episode we're going to start hitting some of these places. Uh, we're going to look for the magic uh, enchanted forest. There's a maze over there that we'll do. This usually has some terrible loot for some reason. For the trouble you got to go through to get to it. So I'm going to fly around off camera, get this thing all um, filled out and ready to go for us. And in the, in the next few episodes we're going to start taking on some of these bosses. So I will catch you guys later. Um, this has been SI Outdoors. You catch us on ShadeCrest.com. Um, yeah, come check us out. Join the fun. Multiple servers. Multiple worlds on each server. So yeah, peace out.